This message is for all the married men out there. Nobody is exempted, including me. And for the single guys who are yet to marry, Muna Kayuna Seed come. This message now for everybody Dick, Tom, and Harry. Una suppose hear this thing like this. It didn't come from my mouth again, it came from somebody's mouth. Somebody else. No before my mouth where it come from again. We could open on our two ears widely here within this man of God talk like this. If you're a married man, please try to protect your wife outside. If you're a married man, leave say your woman don't effort for public. Don't correct her in the public. Try to make things right in the public. Take her inside and caution her. Tell her, babe, this is not the way. Make when I hear him now from this man mouth like this. No be me talk him again. It is very, very important to protect your woman's image out there. Even your girlfriend. No be say people go see and finish outside. You go they expect, make them come respect them outside. Um, once they don't see and finish outside, Kalas, Otilo, you don't finish, be say you don't finish. May when I hear this man of God talk like this. In talk waiting, I suppose here. Waiting, you suppose here. Note. Nobody is exempted as a married man, as a single guy. Even as a single guy, one day you eventually get married. So me when I watch this and when I listen to Ram, when I put them to practice, it did very, very paramount. I love you all. Please make sure you share this video. Share out in the comment section. One love. The way to honor your wife is to fight to defend her integrity. When your woman, your wife is involved in something, don't go out and break her. You find some men, their wife is involved in something, they show up in the public, they start rebuking her. Reduce her to rag. To show that they are men. No matter what is happening, secure her first. If you need to rebuke her, don't rebuke her there to make her look like the devil or the fool in public. Your wife is doing something, she's involved in a crisis, come and defend her, take her away. Resolve the matter, take the responsibility. When you go home, find out what happened. If she's wrong, teach her what she should have done. That way, you've built her. But you see African men, some even come and tell their wives to kneel down and apologize to the person. To show that they don't, they don't, they, they, they are no nonsense men. They are no nonsense. No, you are not a no nonsense man. You are a typical, primitive, myopic African man. Ego, ego. That's what kills the African man. And it's not scripture.